Hello everyone. Today we're reading Ready, Set, Raymond. Ready, Set, Raymond by Vodna Michaud Nelson. Slow down, Raymond. Raymond does things fast. He brushes his teeth fast. He eats breakfast fast. Slow down, Raymond. Chew your food, Mama says. Raymond slows down, but not for long. Raymond dresses fast. He kisses Mama fast. He runs to school fast. Slow down, Raymond. Look both ways, the policeman says. Raymond slows down, but not for long. He reads fast. He counts fast. He draws pictures fast. Slow down, Raymond. There's no rush, his teacher says. Raymond slows down, but not for long. He runs home fast. He eats dinner fast. He brushes his teeth fast. Slow down, Raymond. Time for bed, Papa says. Raymond slowly closes his eyes and... falls fast asleep. Now for story two. Raymond and Roxy. Raymond sees a new girl next door. He wants a friend. Making friends takes time, Mama says. But Raymond cannot wait. He runs next door. I'm Raymond, he says. The girl runs inside. Raymond walks home. Making friends takes time, Papa says. But Raymond cannot wait. He runs to the cookie jar. He runs next door. Raymond gives the girl a cookie. She takes a bite. She smiles with cookie in her teeth. I'm Roxy, she says. Raymond and Roxy become fast friends. Okay. Story number three. New sneakers. Raymond likes to run. He is going to be in a big race. The big race tomorrow. He runs in the house. In the yard. At the park, Raymond runs so much, he wears his sneakers out. Mama buys Raymond brand new sneakers for the big race. They are white like clean sheets. Ooh. Raymond wants his sneakers to stay clean, so he walks slowly in the house. In the yard. To the park. The race is starting. Ready? Raymond looks at the dusty track. Set? Raymond looks at his clean new sneakers. Go! Run, Raymond, run! Roxy shouts. Raymond runs. His sneakers get dirty. But he wins the race. Okay, everyone, so that were three stories from the book Ready, Set, Raymond, about a boy who likes to do everything fast. I hope you liked it as much as I did, and it is a realistic fish fiction, realistic fiction. Anyways, I'll see you next time. Bye!